Welcome back to another video guys. So in today's video we'll be analyzing V15 index. That's velocity 15 index, right? We'll be analyzing from the higher time frame down to the lowest time frame as low as the one minute time frame. So what's the market situation on this index? What do we expect of this index? I see a lot of good trading opportunities on this index. So let's have a look on it together. So coming to the to the weekly time frame as always do I start from the higher time frame round to analyze the market can be the daily time frame it can be the monthly time frame it can be the weekly time frame but yeah we're starting from the weekly time frame on this index so we got our levels and zones which have to first identify or the market direction firstly whichever one so we got our previous direction here which is price being a downtrend creating lower highs and lower lows right this is change support where we got the change resistance at this zone and we got our levels and zones we got this level as a horizontal level of support a key level basically because price has tracked on this level as a support and as a resistance we got the first reaction on this level as a resistance price bought on the test of this level the first time bought the second time bought the third time at this point right so this has been a key level an important level a level to watch out for right because if price is to come back to the same level we're likely to get a reaction on it and price actually did Right, we got this reaction on the test of this level. Price came up to this level. Can see this candlestick week that tested this level, then bought the upside. So this is a key level, a level we have to identify. So we got another level of resistance, a key level at this point. This is a resistance level basically, because we've seen market reaction at this point. Resistance here, resistance here, resistance here, resistance here, resistance here. Come up to market reaction on this level. Let's spot these levels. The first test of this level resistance. Sorry. Alright. Resistance here. Resistance at this point. And resistance as well at this point. So, market has tested this level and directly on this level as resistance and a support at this point. And we got price trend to the upside at this zone. This is the current market structure basically. Price is an uptrend. This index is an uptrend we can tell because it's creating this higher highs and higher low structure. And we have more of bullish candlesticks at this point. Right, daily time frame is clearly seen here. We got our trend resistance at this point. Right, because we've seen price react on the test of this resistance trend. Let's identify it as well. Resistance here. Resistance at this point. Resistance at this zone resistance here as well so this has been a key level an important level a level we should watch out for and we call the last test of this level at the zone as a support a support here right strength support sorry strength support here so this is an important level basically let's watch out for this current market structure because this is where we'll be focused on right let's pay attention to the market formations in this level you can tell that price is an option so focus should be mainly on the buy side of the market so let's identify this level as a level, a key level, an important level, because we've seen price reaction this level as a resistance and as a support. A resistance at this zone, because price sold to the downside, came back to it, gave the retest on it, then sell to the downside, finally broke above it at this point, bought from it as a support, break and retest of a resistance level, turn to support, the price to the upside, the retest on it as well at this point, the price to the upside. So this has been a key level, an important level, basically. And we got on that level. At this zone, this is the current resistance we have, and it's been broken basically. It's been broken because we got the cells at this point resistance, resistance here. So it got broken at this point. And whenever resistance level is broken, it turns to support. We're likely to get price. We test this broken level of resistance now, turn to support. Let's watch out for this level for the buys in the coming days and hours on V50 index. So the four time frame structure is looking good as well. If you can get price sell to the downside from this current price level, looking out for possible buy opportunity on this index. We're expecting the buys on the test of this identified level. And we have this previous market structure. This is an uptrend that got broken. So if price can retest this level, then we're expecting the buys in the coming days and hours on this index. So that's my view basically. This is the four time frame market structure. A retest of this level a return for this zone for the bias let's darken this and make it more specific all right let's um make it um green 
So let's start for this level, this box to buy this index. Watch now for my catch price action formation, like a reversal pattern formation at this point, and but I've had a sure that's pattern a double bottom formation, a candlestick rejection at this point to buy this index. And the one hour time frame as well is looking good, not bad too, because um, there was a break of trend. This was price being a down trend at this point in the one hour time frame, trying to downside, creating lower highs and lower lows. We got the lows at this, so we got the lows of this index at this point. So if price can give a proper retest of this level, then we're buying this index because we've gotten a breakout of this downtrend, right? So this trend is actually invalidated. So price has shifted from a downtrend to an uptrend. So if we can get a proper test at this point of this level, then we're buying this index. So that's my view on V50 index. That's my analysis basically, price action. And the large from the weekly time frame, not the one hour time frame. 30 minute time frame is same, the same as well. 15 minute time frame, right? It's looking good too. So that's my view. If I get price sells to the downside, so the sales expected from this current price level would see because expecting price to sell to the downside. So if I to take any trade opportunity on this index, so watch out for this level, right? To short this index, watch out for this horizontal resistance level because we got price sell here, sell here, sell here. So we got the first rejection at this point as a resistance basically on the 15 minute time frame. First rejection and resistance. So likely to get another rejection at this point. So as a resistance, then we get the sell sit on site. So that's my view and market analysis on this index. So smash like button for market analysis like this and drop a good comment on this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel to my tiny videos. I appreciate the support for this and getting my videos. Jeremy Slot guys, let's do more. I don't know for